Hello ladies and gentlemen, yes, Zeke here again today to bring you another episode of Let's Play FTL Advanced Edition. Okay, new game time. What ship do I want to play? <laughs> I should be playing one of these two ships, but they suck so much. So much suckage, I can't even deal with them. And I don't like the Lanius Cruiser. I know that's probably like fucking crazy, but I just don't. Ah, uh, okay. I, I swear next time I will do something more interesting like the Slug or the Rock or the Lanius Cruiser, but right now I want to play again as the Type B of this ship because it's one of my favorite ships in the game. So I'm going to rename it Invadering, which I swear is a real word. I looked it up before I started the episode. And I will start out. So any of you who do not remember, this has two crew members. One is the pilot, one is the... One is an invader, and basically the only way you can make money or kill ships is by invading to start with. You do also have a boarding drone and a defense drone, and um, I'm just going to strip it for scrap. I don't want to bother waiting around while I fight one of those ships. I could kill it with a boarding drone. I will aid the Federation ship. They do have a cloning bay. But you know, I'm fine. They cannot possibly harm me. I can eventually kill them with what I got here. I just want, the reason I started inside their cloning bay is I want to be able to do maximum the damage to their cloning bay. So, I, I, what am I trying to say here? I started in the cloning bay so I would have as many chances to hit it as possible. Okay, there's three people on this ship. This could cause a wee bit of a problem. You have to get out. Okay, they have a level 2 cloning bay. That could be a bit of a problem. I might need to actually throw down a boarding drone in order to get this shit working. And the boarding drone might have to go into the cloning bay in order to get this shit working. Hmm. Interesting. Very strange first fight. That is definitely a level 2 board... Or, um... I, I wasn't expecting a level 2 clone bay on the first sector. That seems a bit ridiculous if you ask me. That landed in their weapons. Let's get ready to breach! Okay. So they're fighting that. I'm fighting this. I should be able to actually do damage to the clone bay now, which is a good thing. And this guy does. This guy seems very distracted with me. Which is also good. Eventually they'll have stuff to repair and they'll be more concerned about this guy than about my mantises, and I'll be able to take out the cloning bay. I hope anyways, unless they just, like, constant spawn, which is also a possibility. Come on, just do down. Okay, there, there we go. It's down to level one. You have to get out of here. Just die already. Oh, fuck. Okay, these two need to get out of here. They will start fighting off my invader drone, which I'm actually fine with. That's actually better than what they were doing before. And then I'll be able to reinvade their um, cloning bay and hopefully get things sorted out here. Wow, this, this was a bit harder than I initially anticipated for the very first sector in the game. So I want that guy to die first. Then I want... I, him to be invaded, yes, okay. That guy was trying to repair the weapons. Now things should be pretty easy, I think. Please just take out one level of fucking this. One more level. Is this a level was this a level three? Okay, no, they're dead now. They are fucking dead. Just come and fight me, bitch. I got you. I have you now. Well, that was unexpectedly fucking difficult. Um, I will lock on and get myself another Mantis with com with already combat ability. Combat ability, combat ability, combat ability. Fight me. That is that is really fucking good luck, and I'm already psyched about how this shit's going. Let's um save stations here. Save station. Si quieres continuar, hermano, pal, ilumina tu vida. Whoa, Jesus. Pledge to do what I can, I get another quest marker. I have like double quests going on. Double questing time. 
all day happy quest den and I get a defense drone mark 2 Ooh, I may actually replace my boarding drone with that because that's really awesome I, 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 I was trying to think of a good reason to give you but the the reason is it's incredibly fucking good what else can I anti ship beam drone do you want to just give me like all the drones I, I could deal with that okay I actually have to jump back here Oh, I don't actually have to, but I'm gonna try to because that would be more ideal than the way I was going to go. Okay, so I get the ability to invade, like the space. Um, they can actually damage me, but not easily, and I'm gonna teleport into their weapons and kill the fuck out of this man. Okay, so they have three people, it's three on three. Um, it's boy on boy. My sister actually once wrote a song called Boy on Boy. It was fucking hilarious. Uh, that is a bad place for a fire as it's going to spread into the oxygen and kill me. No, that's not at all what I meant to do. Fuck. Okay, okay. So I'm on a pulsar. Um, I need my teleporter real bad. My cloaking's down. I need my med bay. My, fortunately, my med bay is still up. I'm going to need to send people in to put out fires pretty soon. And hopefully that fire does not spread to the O2, or I could be entirely royally fucked. Okay, you two go in here. You go in here just in case. I'm actually kind of hoping my O2 goes down here. As that may be the ideal solution to this problem. Come on. Come on. Just put out the fire already. I don't care if it's here. I mean, I just <laughs> put it out. Why is it so hard? Why are you so mean to me? Okay, two people putting out one fire. This should be super fucking easy, guys. Oh no! One fire in the door room. My only weakness. Well, that was a wee bit more difficult than anticipated. That has to be recovered. I have to um, also heal my boarding drone. You two have got to go heal. So you took some damage there. And now help. Heal and help. That's the motto of this ship. <laughs> Except not at all. In any way. Now I'm probably gonna have to wait for a very slow FTL charge time, so time to have a sip of my coffee. Mmm. Delicious. Oh, I love this ship so much, even though I always mismanage it in the last sector and kill all my crew members. And I mean, I always fucking do that. I don't care about your ion charge. Okay, I can actually jump back and do it this way. But now that I think of it, it is possible that I cannot jump back and do it this way. I am going to actually kill this ship. I know that sounds fucking ridiculous, but it can't hurt me. Um, so I might as well, like, level these guys up in terms of weapons. Oh, it can actually hurt me. What happened to my second level of shields? It locked down my second level of shields. What a dick bag. Okay, fortunately those no longer charge at approximately the same time. So I should be safe for at least a few rounds. And remember, this guy will just eventually take out the entire ship. Which is good. Is, is good. Is good and FTL's charging up. These are charging up. Um, once the weapons go down, there will be no point in having somebody in, well, anywhere, really. And then I can go and repair my weapons, my non-existent weapons, that is. By the way, I apologize already for the amount of boring that this is going to be. Ain't much I can do about it. Ow! Oh, ain't nothing but a hound dog. Just doing all the time. You ain't nothing but a hound dog, but I don't just doing all the time. If you ain't never done a rabbit, you ain't no. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I was about to say. 
So no point in having these guys here anymore. I can start up on some repairs. I hate to level up my mantises in repair, but you know, don't really got a choice in the matter. You gonna put up the piloting now? Nope. This is gonna force me to move on to the engines. If I had a level 3 teleporter, I could have expedited the process at horrible, horrible risk anyways, but not too interested. Um, I really wish I could control this guy because I'd definitely move him to the shield room or the weapons room at this point as they would go out much faster. Actually, so much faster that I might as well put these guys back, back where they belong. Get back to where you once belonged. Past the point of no return, no looking back now. My dreams of yesterday are at an end. Something like that. Just taking another sip of my coffee while I wait. Almost time for me to... Almost time for me to be done with this. I, I want I want the weapons. Ooh, that was almost some unfortunate damage. I do have 114 scrap and it's not even the end of the first sector. So you know, I'm, I'm pretty psyched about how shit's going. There we go. My boarding drone died, but I managed to get all the reward from that. Now can I actually jump out of here in this direction? Yes, I can. Okay, I, I was a bit nervous for a second there. A bit of a noivous novel, you might say. If you used expressions that don't actually exist, I'm not going to accept a bribe. Seems like an idea that I, I'm not too interested in. They got a bomb and a missile. I have three mantises. I, I think I have the advantage. I think advantage is like 100% on me here. Not to mention they seem to only have two crew, which is fucking fantastic. The bomb can't damage me. It can cause me some issues. Oh, you're the one in there. Trico, I don't actually want you gaining experience here, so you go into here. There we go. Well, the victim jumped away super quickly, but you know, I don't regret it anyways. I need the combat experience. Carry you heading here. Everybody is leveling up at a fairly nice clip. And I am still really psyched that first thing I got like another mantis. Pretty fucking awesome. Or as I like to say, prawsome. My favorite word. I'm gonna attack him before he can attack us. They generally do offer something decent, but fuck it, I'd rather just have the scrap at this point. They offer you good deals, but if they don't take their deals, they attack you, break all your shit, and fucking... Basically, they're a bunch of bitch faces. All the pirates who offer you that crap. Okay, Trico, you get the fuck out of there. You get the frack out of there. Oh, no, you get the frack in here instead. Yeah, there we go. Reset priorities. Not a great reward there, but no. They... Oh, do I activate the defense? How do I keep doing that? What's the hockey I keep pressing to activate my defense drone? Six? I haven't pressed six once. I didn't want a defense drone. God damn it. God damn them all. 154 scrap is a great amount of scrap. I don't... I think I want to buy more crew with it, so I need to find myself a store. And ride into the city. Lovely. Quest Bacon! Oh, I'm excited about this. I found Mantis Encampment, but there are too many. Leave before they notice me. They attack me, which for me is the perfect end of this scenario. And I will just jump directly into their shields. Try to take out this goddamn NG. Um, Trico does not need experience, and he's not doing anything too ridiculous, anyways. These two can get the kills. Awesome. I just want everyone to level up. If one person levels up too unevenly, they start taking all the kills because they're doing more damage. Sucks, but it's the truth. Let's move these guys here, go back to positions, and jump away. Yeah, I'll jump away. Yeah. I'm so psyched about this. I'm so super psyched. Inquire about their specialty. Um, sensors. Yes, I will definitely take that. I really wish I had upgraded the sensors before I found that station, though. 
Um, Zoltan, and look at look at this huge, really nice path that I can take. I can take all these hostile sectors, or these hostile sectors, and that friendly sector. This is really good. I have a good feeling about this. I have I have a pretty good idea, and maybe I can get some Zoltans here as well as possibly. Um, hmm. Okay, so I'm going to jump here first, then into the nebula, then out of the nebula. Unfortunately, I can't visit that bottom nebula area. That nebulous nebula. Um, unfortunately, I didn't really think of this, but there could be Zoltan shields in this sector, so I need to go to a shop and grab a weapon as soon as possible. As soon as I am able. And I did not teleport one of my guys over because I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. <laughs> I am an idiot. <laughs> okay, fortunately I should be able to kill one of them while two of them are healing up, if I'm not mistaken. And then I will actually return these guys, heal them all up. My shields will go down entirely and I'll probably take some damage to my hull. Ow, my O2 room. Okay. So I actually now have to recover my O2 room or else I'm truly bugged. Those dick bags. Wow, this is like the most dicky um fucking ship ever. Uh, NG ship. I've never met an NG ship that has been so much dick. Not once in my life. Okay. I had no chance of dodging anyways. So now let's teleport over into the weapons. I can actually take out some of their weapons now, and remember, I can actually use this ship in order to level up by just killing everything, really. Well, especially Trico, apparently. Here, let's go to the engines now. Let's all go to the engines. Kill the NG engines. All day I'll be killing NG engines and drinking my coffee. Oh, they really cannot do much damage to us. T T10 has leveled up now. I'll grab the shields. They may actually just decide to fight me in the shields. For some reason, computers always tend to really, really prioritize shields heavily. You're fully leveled. Do you go to like the pilot or something? Actually, I may even be able to fight them in the med bay pretty soon. You guys go in the med bay right here and fight the hell out of this NG. Indeed, I can. That's Trico. You guys get the kill. Awesome. I realize I could have exploited them more for even more experience than that, but they already gave me enough. I am satisfied with that. I am satisfied. Something about having you by my side or something like that. Oh yeah, I need to go. I need to repair my engines. I forgot how much of a dick this ship was at the very beginning of the game, when it just like instantly took out my oxygen and engines. Which is pretty fucking vindictive early in the early in a fight. Let's go in here. Hopefully, no Zoltan shields turn up. What I'm really hoping for is a distress beacon. Yes, I will definitely make that trade. A distress beacon that has the asteroid field, so I can get the rock ship or the crystal ship. Intruders on board. Intruder. You two go in here. You go in here. Um, this situation sucks. All I can really do is kill them and move on. Can't really do anything else at the moment. You go in there, you're already pretty low health, you go heal up. You go heal up. You go heal up. I just didn't want anybody dying from the explosion. You always gotta watch those Zoltan explosions. Let's get you into the piloting bay. Doesn't matter who's piloting, nobody's leveled up anyways. Lovely. Well, you know, I won't get any scrap for this, but at least I got a tiny bit of combat experience. And their guys appeared back in their ship. I could really use a Zoltan shield bypass, although I doubt I can normally buy that in the Zoltan sector. We're the Zoltans, not to mention we sell our only weakness. Wow, they have a lot of fucking crew. Ah, 
delicious. A lot of waiting around in this ship, but you know, I don't mind that. It makes for a tiny bit of a more casual run earlier on, a tiny bit of a more intense run later on. A tiny bit of more chicken run in um, 2001. Anybody, anybody remember chicken run? Like at the time it was really popular when it came out, but it, it, the popularity really didn't last and now I remember pretty much dick all about it. Like the villains were humans and the the good guys were chickens and there was a chicken who was a stunt artist and I just don't even fucking know really. Okay, I'm gonna head to the store, hopefully I can buy a weapon, that's why I've been saving so much money. Tom Banks! <laughs> Sorry, I just really like that there's a guy named Tom Banks there. Okay, so they do not have weapons. What they do have is Tom Banks, Aisha. And we're gonna want both of those guys. I'm actually gonna want all these guys. Um, okay, that was a ridiculous purchase. But the, there, there was a reason for it. There was a reason for it. I want the NG as the pilot. I want you on engines for the extra power. I want a fourth invader, and that's pretty much it. I realize I just bought a ridiculous amount of shit. Like an absolutely insane amount of shit. But I think I can make it back with four borders. Except in this particular fucking situation. Okay, unfortunately it is impossible for this ship to kill me or even hurt me. And it is very possible for me to just board the ship and kill it. Although it will take a little while, so let's have a chat. Maybe more about Chicken Run again. What else came out in that time period that was fairly popular in terms of cartoons? It was kind of that weird, like, transitional period between 2D animation and 3D animation, and, like, some things were still claymation, which was kind of weird. Um, so, really not that much good came out, and to be honest, I'm still kind of fucking uninfatuated with 3D animation. Like, I fucking... I hate Frozen. I hated it when I watched it, I hate it now, I hate even the fucking song that everybody loved for a while and has been singing, which I let it go, it's like an alright song. It's like your standard fucking belted out music song, I, I've heard it a million fucking times before. Sorry, I may even start to hate it more and more as people like it more and more, but even at the time. Like just watching it, I, w I didn't watch it and think, hey, this is really good. I watched it and thought, wow, this gun is a piece of shit. Oh no, my O2. What a travesty. Um, I do have a pilot and engine guy, right? Yeah, okay. I was just wondering if I had the proper to evade people hanging out. I should really upgrade my engines at some point soon. It would be super cheap since I only currently have level one. Yeah. Let's see, what else? There was like, was did Tangled come out around then? I never even watched Tangled. I've watched like a scene or two from it now, and to be honest, it also looks like crap. Why am I thinking cartoons? I don't know. I, I've never been one for like a massive amount of movie trivia, especially years of release. I just don't even fucking know. Uh, gen generally, uh, never mind, I'm not gonna go there. I was gonna start talking about anime, but... The anime I like is very, very fucking select. It's, it's not... it's not just everything, and it's definitely not like the big three, as people tend to call them online. Okay, come on, destroy the weapons, destroy the rest of the ship, and then we can get the fuck out of here. And maybe pick up some sort of weapon at some point. I would do so much for a weapon. I'm just, I haven't even had the chance to get a weapon. And I just got like this full crew and can I use it? Fuck no. What do you think you are? Them using user user face? User face? I kinda like that. Sounds like something you'd call somebody who was like a user play character in Reboot or something? I don't know. Fuck you, user face. Or maybe you're like using her face as... Never mind, never mind that. What I was about to say would have been kind of gross to some people, so I'm going to avoid it. I, I like the three fuel reward there, and I have fucking tons of drone parts. I'm gonna actually wait for my boarding drone to repair itself. Before I jump away, yeah, I'll jump away. 
Okay, another Zoltan ship. Why are you moving into attack? I can't do anything. I'm fucking helpless against you. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm just trying to talk random bullshit, but... I mentioned I got a third screen for my setup here. I, I now have the screen to my left, the screen in the middle, and a fairly big screen on the right that is, like, more than 1080p. It's, like, 12... 1280 by 1920 instead of 1080 by 1920. So that's kind of cool, I guess. I'm, I'm a fan. I'm not a fan as in like something that fans your face. I'm a fan as in um, I, I enjoy things. I was trying to think of a third synonym, or not synonym, homonym for sa fan, but I couldn't think of one. There's fan as in something that fans you. Then there's fan as in you like something a lot. And then there's fantastic? No, I don't know. There's, there's flan. I'm actually not a fan at all. I'm a big pile of flan. Very little known fact. Uh, there is a species, a whole race of participated in the study. I got some scrap. Not a great reward, really, but got nothing better to do. And I can't seem to fight anything in this sector because they all have fucking Zoltan shields. All of them, all of them, yes really all of them have bullshit Zoltan shields, I'm gonna board the fuck out of you. Yeah, fuck all y'all. You're gonna die! Wait a second, I should really get what's his name out of here so he doesn't get any kills? There we go, I am Pulse Imminent, oh no! Quick! Retreat! Oh, I can't retreat yet. No. Honestly, not much the Iron Pulse can do to hurt me other than slow down my fucking retreat. Which it didn't even do. Excellent. Also, don't slow down my healing either. I would really like reconstruct a teleport at this point. I think that would be quite nice. I'd also like to have some shields available for when I jump away. Eh, you know, that's good enough. Distress beacon up here, I will definitely visit. Um, dock and try to rescue survivors. Hey, I got Wash Jones. I scream like a cicada till I see right out the bush. I ride a train to Memphis when there's cotton to be sold. To understand me better, you all ought to follow me home. I, I may. I clean up, I make a wish, I clean a fish, boy, that's why they call me Wash Jones. Okay, so I'm gonna have to, like, alternate people here. Won't matter too much, um... Fortunately, I have one of the right people in. I should have actually, but he should get a kill here. Either way, let's rotate them out before these two die and rotate these two in. Don't be greedy. Let everybody have their kill. Everyone have their fun. Unfortunately, the fun is killing, but, you know, I've never mind some good killing here and there. Always good. It's all in good fun, right, guys? No one minds. No one gets too hurt, at least. And they be dead. They be dead, yes they be dead, I hate to tell you boy, but they be dead, they are so dead. Maybe they got deaded when they... I should probably save these positions, you know, just in case I need to, because that's a smart thing to do. Um, search among the stores, see if somebody will sell to me. I could kill this ship. Uh, if... Oh, uh, that's so much health. I'm just gonna fly away. This was the worst possible outcome. Like, if it landed in one of these two rooms... You know, it might actually kill it fast if it lands in one of those two rooms. Let's see. No, it lands in the very center. Might as well even just turn it off. No point. It's actually slightly better this way because he'll just like bounce back and forth between two systems and take them out if he lands in one of the side areas, but if you land in the very middle, the system will never actually repair itself. 
so it is impossible to kill the ship. Unless you have a weapon, which I don't. Which I very much do not. Do not. That's what my baby said to me. Yeah, do not. Let's go to the rebel controlled. Oh, I thought that was the rebel like stronghold. That's too bad. I, I would really like to visit a rebel stronghold. I've never had much of a chance to jump around in one. I think there's probably like new and interesting quests and cool events that give you tons of scrap and more fucking pulsars. This is like the run of the fucking pulsars. There's so many pulsars. I'm gonna need to activate my defense drone here. Wow, poor guy. Let's get Trico out of there in order to give everybody else experience. Okay, who needs the experience most? Definitely Aisha who just got a kill. And let's let her get the next two kills as well. Oh, okay, I went to the wrong place for this. I want Aisha to get the kills. Fuck off, Trico got the kill. Okay, whatever. Nope, don't do that actually. Everybody move to one room and then teleport back. And I think this got ionized the second I teleported back, so apparently that was a fairly good move. Might as well repair the drone control, you know. Because I got nothing better to do. Turn everybody to their initial positions and jump away. Again, try to explore as many sections as possible. Just see if you can find distress beacons. Um, definitely repair 10 damage. Seems like a real good deal. And I only have one fuel left. I would like to go to that distress beacon, but I think it's a real bad idea. I need fuel. And I need to jump away in order to possibly get the fuck your FTL. You motherfuckers, I'm gonna kill the shit out of you as fast as possible. I'm not even gonna fuck around with like taking out your systems. Or trying to min-max experience gain here. You're just dying. Oh, six fuel. <laughs> that is so nice. I'm also so lucky, I, I gotta say, I'm more, you're more likely to get more rewards if you take out the ship like that, but that doesn't change the fact that it's a lucky outcome. And I think I want to jump down because the right side of the sector is fairly sparse, so I need to kind of get as much done as possible right here. Okay, so this is actually a good opportunity for me. I will end up killing at least one of them very quickly. Because, you know, shield room and shit. Trico can get the fuck out of there because he doesn't really need to get the experience for this kill. And these guys can start taking out the weapons. The weapons go marching one by one. Hurrah. Are you max level now? Yes, you are. Hurrah. The weapons go marching one by one. Hurrah. Hurrah. The weapons go marching one by one This song doesn't make any fucking sense And they all come marching down To the ground To something Rain Bum 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 Should be getting plenty of experience here On the combat front All's EXP on the combat front Honestly, these two should maybe be in here And these two should be taking out Something like the piloting Let's make it piloting. These two will be on shields to attract the people in the med bay. And yeah, pretty sure that's good enough. Oh, that's all. Well, once the people in the med bay get out of the med bay, I can go and destroy the med bay. Do I have this right? Yes, I do. Oh, there's only one person left alive. No, he's dead. Contact the Federation ship. They give me a bunch of shit. Get everybody into the same room and teleport them back. Awesome. Unfortunately, I'm gonna to need to like stagger some heals around here because I got everybody damaged in that situation But that's all right shouldn't take me too long might end up upgrading my med bay just you know for the sake of healing a bit faster I can always power down other things to power up my med bay at the end of a fight. Oh my sensors are slightly down Okay, so they have mind control that's a tiny bit of a pain in the ass, but the thing is, I don't really care. Unless something 
important get where one of my mantises get mind controlled. In which case, I'm gonna be in a bit of a sore spot. Now, go and repair the fuck out of this. Fortunately, it's only level one mind control. Actually, let's spread people out just in case. You can start repairing the sensors, I guess. Because at very worst, now I just lose one level of something. Actually, you should all go into systems with multiple levels. Actually, except for that system. That system should be ignored. Okay, you're taking out the teleporter. That shouldn't matter too much because I will just fight you two and then I'll move you both into the med bay. There we go. Med bay time for Hitler intro. Oh, thank fucking Christ checks for that. I mean, them moving into that into there specifically. Actually, Aki actually needs some health recovery. There we go. Mind control is down. Considerably less bullshit for me to deal with. I, I know um, you guys are probably sick of watching me, in quotation marks, fight these goddamn ships right now. But there ain't much I can do about it. Ain't much at all. Taking out the piloting. You know, this whole taking out the piloting thing would be incredibly useful. If I had some way of then attacking the ship, and this ship doesn't even have shields. Oh, I should really get like level three teleporters soon, but I need, I'm saving my money so I can buy a weapon. Any weapon. Can someone get me a weapon? I could use it to kill these assholes. Don't take out the engines. I need those to fucking dodge shit. Please don't take out the engines. I'm just singing about what's happening. Let's make this some sort of opera about sitting in one damn place all the time. Don't take out my sensors, Trico. Why are you such an ass? Now I have to go and heal both you and Aisha. You fucking dick, go back to the sensor room so that you can heal. Heal up? No, that's wrong. I screwed up my opera. I screwed up my opera. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this to almost be down again, then I'll use, I will use the same strategy. Almost down. I just don't want my ship taking any damage, so I have to fight my own guys, right? That's how this shit's gonna work. Okay, take down mind control again, please. Separate these fuckers. Jones is slightly damaged, might as well go heal you. Perfect, I guess. Two more damage. Please just hurry the fuck up. All you need. All you need is damage. All you need is damage. It just recovered itself instantly. I thought that wasn't even possible. It doesn't work when it's the piloting in those like segmented ships. I tried before. Maybe I left and it managed to repair itself then? Thank fucking Christ checks for that. I don't even care about my boarding drone, I'm just moving on. Okay, so the unfortunate thing here is I can't actually jump upwards to these sectors. So I have to jump downwards and hopefully visit all these and then go to the exit. Demand the surrender of the goods, of course. They have a missile launcher. Oh fuck, I didn't return everybody to position. Everybody back to positions. Wrong positions. Why do you even have those positions? Okay. So I'm teleporting into their weapons. They don't they do not have a med base, so they are royally fucked. Who needs leveling? Kara needs leveling and Aisha needs leveling. You two get the fuck out of here and go to like the piloting area or something. be able to get all the kills here even though oh 
something hurt there. Yeah, might as well take out the O2 or something. Hey, I, I even got a crew member for it. I don't know what I'll use him for. Door system, I guess? I could also improve my sensors, but I don't know if we can see a point, really. Get you two in here. Um, I'll have to save positions afterwards, so I'm not going to use the return to position button. I guess he could be our weapons man. If I ever, if I ever fucking get a weapon, that is. At this point, I'm going to need to kill people by letting them repair shit in the final sector or two. Which is goddamn ridiculous. There's a store. Maybe I can get a weapon there. Nothing particularly interesting in this sector. I mean, this, um... What are they called? Node? I'll just call it a node for now. Intervene and defend the outpost. Outposts have to pay me, so that's at the very least an advantage. Actually, a pretty scary ship. So I'm just gonna take it out as quickly as possible and not fuck around with min-maxing experience. Maybe I will fuck around with min-maxing experience. Here, you two get out of there and go into the engines. There we go, perfect. Need to recover three people, which is the exact amount of room I have in my med bay anyways. Oh, I actually, actually Trico took some damage too. I just didn't even notice because he's such a dickbag, stealing all the experience. Why is- oh, that's the wrong fucking NG. I, I didn't even realize the NG in the shield room had taken damage. Lovely. Now, how's there? You're full, you're full, you're full, and you are not? Yeah, you only have one level. I need Aisha to gain some levels on her own. So this is not going to be an ideal sector by any means. But, you know, it, I still got a fair amount of stuff. I can use mind control, reconstructive teleport. So, yeah, that works. Drone recovery arm? No, mind control, though, yes. Long-range scanners? Yes. What else do I have? Mantis pheromones? I might at some point sell mantis pheromones. I don't... I actually do need the boarding drone at this point in order to kill certain ships. I might as well improve my engines a bit. I have nothing else to spend my fucking money on. I think I have extra power right now. You know, I'll just max out that. Perfect! I, I don't need a med bay anymore, pretty much, because I have reconstructive teleport. So I can never upgrade that again and I'll be fine. Reconstruct teleport was a really... Well, actually, it generally shows up at some point. You know, I will even sell six drone parts. I'm feeling confident enough to do that and to not need to buy more. And I will definitely fight this ship. Hopefully it's not an automated drone. It's an automated drone. I'm just going to strip it and move on. Jump, next sector. Um, Mantis controlled or pyre controlled? Mantis controlled might be the way to go here, but I'd like to visit like here, 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 and here, just so I can get like all these red points. Tons and tons of combat, so I will do pyre controlled for now. And look at all this combat. Already, I'm not regretting my decision. I'm regretting my decision. Mind control is damn useless in this situation. Um, I wish I had level three things. Boarding drone can go up. Please focus on weapons sooner than later. We've got some extra evasion chance there. That's really nice, at least. Reactivate boarding drone. Get you back in shields. Piloting can go down. I, I'm planning on taking out this ship. I know you guys are probably sick of it, but I, I could at this point fast forward. But instead, let's talk about something I don't know about again. Um, upholstery. Um, you know, I, I have those like two big upholstered chairs, but they really, really suck. I'm not sure why. Like some people just choose the worst fucking fabrics for upholstery, and this is one of those examples. Whoa, they are fire bombs. 
Sing us a song, you're the fire bomb. Sing us a song tonight. Cause we're all in the mood to be fiery and you have us feeling alright. Please put out the fire before it fucking explodes. Oh, you did put it out before it exploded. What a bunch of dick bags. Now you guys need to heal, and now I have no dodge chance as well, so that's always a lot of fun. Oh, I didn't repair the... Okay, repair the O2 room. Come on, guys. You can do it. I know you can. I've seen you repair O2 rooms before. Okay, another fairly easy, easy get there in terms of putting out a fire. Fortunately, the fire bomb doesn't actually do system damage, which is definitely a plus. There goes my weapons. Well, you know, at least they started in that room. Okay, fuck it, I'm jumping away. I'd like to go to the store, but I'd like to get some combat done first. Um, attack the shit out of that slaver scum, I think? Yeah, that's, that's what I want to do. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> okay, okay, close all doors. Remember, I have reconstructed teleport here. I desperately need to, um, get this O2. Okay, that's done. You guys get in here. You get in here and repair this. Nobody die, please. I needed a defense drone. Thank God that shit missed. I activated the defense drone. Um, O2 is being repaired. You guys fucking teleport somewhere, just anywhere, into weapons and fucking middle of the ship. Sure, why not? You get mind controlled and start taking out the shields. And everybody just fucking dies. How about that? Both my guys are fully leveled in terms of evasion now, which is good. Um, you two get in here. Oh yeah, door systems, huh? Advanced door systems. Advanced door systems, I can't believe that shit hit me right now. What a dick bag. What a dick bag of a ship. What a shit bag of a dick bag. I don't even know what that is. Okay, at least right now I actually have Aisha selected. She is the one who is nearly full health. So that one there. This guy is gonna need to move out eventually. You get, you two get in here. You get in here. Um, Rockman, I guess. Hey, he's a fucking super good weapon, Rockman. I guess I'll dismiss my useless goddamn human. And eventually, when I get a weapon, the weapon Rockman will be mine. You guys all get to where you belong. Teleport all y'all back. And you're all back to full health, which is super nice. You actually have to get healed up. This needs to close and reoxygenate. You need to get back here. You can now get in there and repair that. Yeah, super good weapons. I appreciate that. He can also put out fires quite easily. You know, I should just... No, I can't permanently deoxygenate down here. I wish I could. You should be able to turn off oxygen in certain rooms. That makes a lot of sense to me. Though it appears to not be possible. Damn. Okay, so I want to go to this store. I pretty much have to go to this store, actually. In order to heal up a bit and maybe get a weapon. Please have weapons. Have weapons? You don't have weapons! Why does no one have weapons? <laughs> Look at me, what a weapon! Okay, well, I'll repair a bit. And jump around. Um, there's a ship and an asteroid field there. 
This is an unvisited location with nothing in it. I'm actually going to go visit the asteroid field. I, I just want to fight the ship, really. And it had to be one of these motherfuckers, didn't it? Again, it is possible that I could kill it, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to jump away. The ship can hurt me if um, my defense drone has a hard time focusing between rocks and missiles. Like that, for instance. But, you know, my FTL drive is charging fairly fast now. I have a decent evade chance. That should be good. That should be all good. Distress beacon. Good. Finally, something I can fucking deal with. I have lots of crew, so, yeah. NG crew to calm down the infected, get a bunch of fuel, a bunch of other stuff too. Please find a fucking shop. I need a shop that has a weapon in it. I've never seen this many shops without weapons. Like actually never, ever, 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 never seen a shop like this before. This is another asteroid field. You know what, since it is an asteroid field, I'm actually going to go ahead and upgrade my engine once more and upgrade my power once more. Just to get that extra 5% dodge chance, bring it up to 40% dodge. Move in to examine, intruders on board. I thought that was an asteroid field that <laughs> you invaded me in my teleporter. They do have an anti-ship battery, but that's alright. Look how fast my fucking FTL drive is charging. That's ridiculous. Jump away. Yeah, I'll jump away. I thought I jumped into that asteroid field. Apparently I misclicked. Okay, um, uh, actually, no, not enough power. I'm gonna make power this down, right? Fortunately, they're in an asteroid field and they have no fucking, um, shields, so I've won. I actually could have not done the boarding drone at all and I'll just eventually win. There we go. Perfect, they're taking damage, I'm taking no damage. I could really use some more damage to their weapons, but... Their lasers are a wee bit scary. Oh god, their missile launches back up. I might need to alternate between defense and boarding drone for a while. Perfect. Okay, that thing is dead. Is there a, is there a store? Can I go to a store, please? That's all I want. One weapon. Any weapon. Search for the ship, catches your eye, grab the stasis chamber. I'll fucking drop Mantis Pheromones. The chances of actually finishing this quest are, are pretty fucking low, but I know I have to try. I've got to try. I got minus three fuel for that? A fucking dick bag of an event. I didn't even know that was a possibility. Engines are entirely down, apparently. Just waiting for the ship to reoxygenate now, because why not? I, I don't need to heal my fighters, by the way, which is why I'm just leaving them low health. They'll heal themselves eventually. Uh, get my Exeter NG in here, too. Repair this super fast. Super fast, super fast, and just in time for breakfast. Get everybody back to where they belong. And my, my Rockman's like, I'm a weapons guy, but you guys have no fucking weapons. No. Yeah, I can't actually beat the stasis pod quest because here's where I have to do it. No fuel, let's turn the distress beacon on and wait. Wait again. That's all I can do. Okay. Oh! Oh fuck! That is quite the goddamn ship. Okay, let's um... Let's get this shit going, I guess. They don't have a missile launcher, they just have a bunch of fucking bombs. 
so that should do the trick in terms of killing a lot of people, right? Um, power that the fuck up. And actually power mind control the fuck up too. And fuck you. Okay, taking their weapons down, because why the fuck not? Enemy FTL is delayed because they have no pilot. It's always a good thing. Let's get you two in here and you two in here. Is Aisha fully leveled yet? Which one is she? That one down there? Yeah. You get to fight alone. How are you doing? Almost there. Just one more kill. I actually want this guy to heal himself. Because I want her to win. Perfect. Now you two, get the fuck over here and kill this asshole. Oh, look at all that glorious fuel. So perfect. Let's get Banks and Jones to heal up, because why the hell not? Then I can carry on. Well, they did catch up quite a bit, I will admit. Um, if I find a store, I will now sell the damaged stasis pod. Intruders on board. One intruder on board who is a flying piece of crap. Um, this ship can indeed hurt me, especially if those happen to have a simultaneous charge time. So let's actually cause some havoc aboard their ship by doing this. Fortunately, both of those missed, so that wasn't a big deal at all. And then I will cause you more havoc by doing this. Remember, all my guys are now max leveled. I don't really have to care about leveling up at all. They do have a med bay, though. But that should not matter, really. I can take down their shields, so they'll be highly concerned about that for no particular reason. And remember, now that they have three guys, again, I should be able to kill one fairly easily because they can't micro properly. Awesome. I could also chase them down and kill them, um, which I should really do because that's what makes a lot of sense. Okay, actually, I'll get two people to come in here. And I will do that for the sole purpose of waiting. Okay, pretty much what I want to do is have these two in here. There we go. I'm just waiting for this guy to almost die, and then when he has almost died, I can kill him like that. That is exactly what I was looking for. Perfect, and I get a shield. How's my current shields man? Shield man. Shield man, come together. Not very good, but he is and A-N-G. I'm gonna have to dismiss you, Rockman. And take everybody back. Oh, and absolutely have to jump into a sun. Well, you know, the sun doesn't matter too much for me. This has fairly good venting in it. As long as I don't start any fires inside the fucking O2 room, that should be good. Oh, no, you fucking don't. Oh, he wasn't going to teleport anyways. He was going to join us and then destroy the piloting. Well, shit, I guess I just wasted my time. Yeah, I'm wasting my time. I'm just moving on. Can I depower this? It should be an option to turn off the, um... Oh, God! That is way too large of a burst laser. Let me head the fuck into here and take that shit out. I took up the wrong thing first. Come on again. Yeah, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Oh, I guess I should probably put out the fires on my ship too, huh? Kill the rock man, and then I can head away. 
First laser mark one. You know, it's not much, but it is a fucking weapon. So <laughs> I'm happy. I am happier than I'm so happy. Happy, happy as can be. Hey, you would not believe how happy I am. We're gonna save them or die trying. Okay, you're Tim immediately messaged looking for a war. Uh, I'll save the Federation, aren't you? Um, we're gonna save them or die trying. Added, okay. The latter being more likely, still we can potentially help and your precious fleet prove yourself first, meet me at the coordinates. I don't think I've seen this quest unless this is the rock ship quest, which I have never actually done. Should have time to visit a lot of sectors around here. So I will do that, and I will also upgrade my weapons once, upgrade my power twice. And actually get a burst laser going. Well, I don't need the burst laser going. I might need it sometime. What I do need is fuel. Most definitely. And enemy FTL charging, enemy fuck you charging. Enemy, you're gonna die. Charging. Okay, so their pilot is gone, so the FTL is delayed. Um, I could have also just mind controlled their pilot, I guess. These two will just die automatically. How did they get by my shields? Oh yeah, they just have enough shields, I guess. Let's get everybody in the weapons here. Eey, that is rough. Just that sheer amount of shots that they can shoot. Just the sheer amount of shots that they can shoot. All the way, de-shot. De-shot yourself. De-shot yourself if you don't care what you want now. All the people you love in a river of blood, and don't forget the guns. You're gonna need them today. So at this point, I'm just waiting for this guy to be unmind controlled. That should be sooner than later, really. Here, why don't you join me in the shield room? Ah, uh, because the O2 is down. Here, why don't you just die in there? That makes a lot of sense. Okay, I fortunately did get two fuel. I'm really hoping there's a store I can visit soon. I'll use my NGs, both of them at the same time, to repair that breach. Into the breach. I love how fast NGs repair shit. It's so fun. So much fun. Get some repairs done. Okay, so there is a store and there is a quest which is near the sun. Okay. I can deal with that. So I will go to the store first because they could have another weapon for me. Do you have a weapon? They have weapons, except it's another burst laser mark one. Oh, just kind of a crappy weapon. Fuck. Could get battery backup instead? Why are the weapons so crappy? I just don't even understand. I just don't. Okay, I can sell the damage stasis pod. There's no way I can possibly get that quest because I'm already in the Rock Home Worlds and I need to get the Crystal Crew member before I go to the Rock Home Worlds. I can pick up backup battery because I find it to be very useful late in the game. Explosive replicator could be nice. It would allow me, if I ever got a missile, to use missiles properly. But I think what I need is fuels and drone parts, a couple at least. Maybe some pole repairs. And then I'll jump away again. Oh, there's another store. Oh, oh, there's no way back to the exit. Well, this is gonna be a rough sector, guys. Okay, the rock ship, um, okay, so we actually have to let this ship get away. Is the main thing with it. So let's actually activate a defense drone here. And, um, that's pretty much all I can do to even hope that it gets away. Fence drone is still activated. Let's move you over here. Get some repairs done on the drone system. Why can I not dodge? I, I don't understand why my dodging is not a thing. Jump imminent. Please just jump away. Okay, there we go, it jumped away. 
Add quest marker to the next sector. I'm now repairing the doors. I should probably, like, repair them a bit faster or something. Maybe I can do this. Oh. Okay, now, never mind. Don't need to. You three go over there. You go over here. And then I can jump away. This is gonna be hell, by the way. Like, absolute bloody fucking hell. Fortunately, I can go in here and use reconstructive teleport in order to get kills in their weapons. ABS is gonna be a problem, but it's a problem that I can deal with. I don't actually want to mind control because that will decrease the speed at which I uh, kill them, which I can't actually deal with at the moment. Okay, now I'm in trouble. I have no doors and I can't, I need to scream. Um, that doesn't even make sense, but I basically just need to go here as soon as possible and repair the O2 and then repair the doors then get the fuck out of there and then oh that's down too huh that I can actually recover all of these guys they will be full health I can use them to start repairing the doors and repairing other things as well and I can jump to another battle how are my doors doing almost there They're gonna die. <laughs> that really hurts. That really hurts. Um, I should have closed the doors. No, don't go back to positions. Do not return to original positions. Okay, you go here. Now I only have two invaders. You go here, you also go here, but take this direction because that's the only thing that makes sense. I will take some more damage because, you know, why the fuck not? I'm almost dead. I am very, very close to dead. What I should have done there was actually just jump away as quickly as possible and avoid the combat. But I did not think of that. I need to get some more people in repairing here. Oh, never mind, I'm dead. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode, even though I kind of fucked up my jumping and that's how I died. And if you enjoyed it, please give me a like, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.